Every two minutes, someone in the UK is diagnosed with cancer. Cancer affects or will affect one in three of the population. It is the number one fear for the British public, ahead of debt, knife crime and Alzheimer's disease. A nurse came out, took me into a doctor who said immediately, do you mind if this lady sits in? She's a social worker. And he told me I had a tumour. And after that, to be perfectly honest, I don't remember anything else. Here at St Luke's Cancer Centre in Guildford, campaigners have been working tirelessly to raise the funds to buy a machine that will offer a revolutionary new treatment to cancer sufferers in Surrey, West Sussex and Hampshire. This cutting-edge new treatment, stereotactic radiotherapy, is only available at selected UK hospitals. That means cancer patients from this area either do not get offered the treatment at all or have to travel long distances while feeling ill and vulnerable. Five years ago, Sue was one of the first patients to receive stereotactic radiotherapy for a surgically inoperable brain tumour. If I had been able to get this treatment locally here at the hospital, it would have made a huge, massive difference to the way things went. Andy Fenning was treated with image-guided radiotherapy for prostate cancer in 2008. He had to have his treatment in America, as at that time, similar treatments were not readily available in the UK. I would have gone to the ends of the world quite frankly, to, to have that treatment because I was convinced it was right for me. Unlike many state-of-the-art treatments, stereotactic radiotherapy can be used on a wide variety of cancers, and that means the machine will be used on a daily basis. Consultant Dr Richard Schaffer has had extensive experience of this treatment, and he and his team will start treating patients as soon as the equipment is in place. Stereotactic radiotherapy is able to give a very large dose of radiotherapy to the tumour without giving a dose to the surrounding tissues and in that way it can actually reduce the side effects while still being able to cure the actual tumour itself. Patients receiving this treatment will be lying down on a couch with something to keep them still. The machine will move around them, it will feel a bit like a scan, they won't feel anything, there will be no pain or heat or light, there are no knives or scalpels and no anaesthetic. This really is a painless treatment. As the treatment ended, he said he was extremely happy with what had happened. And I used to go to the clinic, first of all, three times a year. And every time I went, it continued to work after I finished the treatment. So, and it just kept shrinking, kept shrinking. If I hadn't had the treatment, I frankly don't know. I would have had to have chosen a different treatment, a treatment that I wasn't happy with that would have had significant risks of side effects, and who knows? If I hadn't had stereotactic therapy, I would either be extremely disabled or I would be dead. Stereotactic radiotherapy could soon, with your help, be available to everyone locally. I've been affected by cancer in a few ways. Last year, my grandma died because of bowel cancer, and that really affected me and my family, and a few years before that, my other grandma was diagnosed with breast cancer. Luckily she survived, but my other grandma unfortunately died. I don't think there's anyone who would argue that fighting cancer any way that we can is of the utmost importance. Uh, the reality is cancer's out there. It strikes one in three of us and it will affect our lives in some way or someone you know. We could have in Guildford this state-of-the-art technology which is going to save lives, is going to make cancer treatment a lot less invasive, a lot easier, it's going to improve the treatment for brain tumours, prostate cancer, all these things. And we thought, yes, we want to raise money for that. We're almost there, we now just need £150,000 to reach our target. And tonight, you can help us do it. Anybody watching this film, if you can donate some money to this unit, I don't think you can understand what it will mean to people with tumours. It's everything. If you could donate anything you could to make this course possible, it would be brilliant. We're really excited. We're getting so close. Please, please, please help us get there. Have another drink and put your hand up and give them lots of money. Thanks. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. We hope you're all having an amazing evening. Um, and let's go with the auction. And I looked up. Sorry. <laughs>